very odd altogether. And there are ways in which that could occur both in nature and in the lab. Nothing seems to specifically suggest whether this virus was most likely to be adapted, evolved, or maybe even engineered. Uh-oh, smoking gun time here. Whoa, so I think it becomes a question of how do you put all this together, whether you believe in this series of coincidences, what you know of the lab in Wuhan, how much could be in nature, accidental release or natural event. I am 70-30, maybe 60-40, leaning towards engineered versus natural. This is Jeremy Farrar on February 2nd. After talking with a, a virologist, said, you know, that furin site, really kind of odd. And it stands out like a sore thumb. And now that we, we have the full genetic code, we can say it really stands out like a sore thumb. In fact, now that I know what I know, if I was a prominent virologist and I have that code, I just look at it and I go, oh, this thing absolutely was engineered. And I'll show you why in just a second. But they knew this. All right. So this is still from that same email, the big smoking gun. Uh, this is from Jeremy Farrar. This is more reflections continued. All right. So remember, this one up here ends with I am 70, 30, 60, 40. You can see that line at the very top in white. Now from Bob, from somebody named Bob. I'm going to assume that's Bob Gary, but it's an assumption. From Bob, <clears throat> he writes here, quote, before I left the office for the ball, I aligned NCOV with the 96% bat coronavirus sequence at WIV, I assume that's rat TG13. Except for the receptor binding domain, the RBD, the five, the S proteins are essentially identical at the amino acid level. Well, all but the perfect insertion of 12 nucleotides that adds the... So yeah, I'll add the link into this video. Y'all are making me fucking do. Are you kidding me? Jesus Christ, people. We've been watching this for a long time. And we have on this channel, right here, predicted quakes to the minute, magnitude, and place on the planet. Thousands of fucking times. Right here on the live show. On this channel. Right here, you don't have to go any further. Go on down to the beginning. Oldest first. Just like I've done over here on my bit shoot, I keep sending you to. Go to my oldest first. Work your way up. If you haven't worked through every fucking one of these, you don't know a goddamn thing about what I said or what is going on, obviously. Because I've got people. <laughs> talking like I'm crazy um, that's fine but you're not allowed to say that until you go through my material and see how goddamn accurate I've been right down to this last comment that I got here just a few minutes ago this one Sergio and I gave you an extended answer and explained to you, I've repeated myself until I'm dizzy. I'm dizzy. I have said this so many times. Easier to catch and deadlier. Over here. I talk about that a lot. A lot. Yeah, I was affected by it. I sure was. Where are we in this progression? This has been a long road with this. Trying to educate people. From a standpoint of... I was informed by a legislator. I was told what was going to happen the day they offered my son and I a bunker. There is one reason and one reason only that we're actually looking at the possibility of a nuclear war coming. 
it's the same reason you're living this madness that you can't figure out today because you haven't gone here and seen what I had to say about it. That's very obvious in the way you speak. You didn't pay attention. You didn't even go look. That is your first problem, Sergio. And I don't mean to single you out because it's been eight hours of the same thing over here with people that have this page right here and this page right here notice there are two of them I have two because I have been blocked for 30 days on each one of these accounts so many times I can't count this one has 411 friends this one has over a thousand and both of them have well over a thousand on the block list <laughs> they look the same one of them has 1.1 K friends over here and over there on my other page since 20 and 14 I have been very loud about what is coming. I have sounded insane several years. And I, I, I don't stop sounding crazy, I guess, to new people every day. I was a senator's investigator. Not only that, as far as I can find, I'm the only fucking unanimous decision in legislator history. Against the core cu curriculum. I'd say that puts me in the top tier of investigators. Now, if you haven't ever been offered a bunker by a senator, and if you haven't ever been told by the senator, we have to get rid of some of the population because if there's 7 billion people, when we go down there, they will be down there too. See, that's their only motivation to keep you out of their fucking bunkers. Why is that? I've gone over that several fucking times, too. This is the very day I disclosed to Senator Davis our moon was doing cartwheels because our axis shifted. And I was told about how they were going to thin the herd. I didn't like it. Their only motivation is to keep you out of the bunkers. Just in case I stuttered or was speaking Greek, which I don't know how to speak. Because it seems like people don't understand where I'm coming from. I was offered a bunker, were you? Were you offered a bunker for your fucking child and refused it? No, I did. Because I couldn't fucking sit here silently while you ran around confused about shit. I couldn't be in a dark room with people like that. My soul wouldn't allow me to be quiet. And I am at, well, others would look at it as great risk. I know creators got my back. I don't really give a fuck. You can take my fucking life out of this world. But the point is, I would have to face my maker and the rest of eternity knowing what I did. I ain't going out like that. I will to my dying day, to the best of my ability, warn you without fucking elaboration or lies or trying to beef up anything. North Korea is going to launch because they can. Russia because of Ukraine. And China because of the South Chinese Sea. 
and you can go to these two pages here that I just showed you and see where I've been saying the same fucking words since the day I stepped down. I'm not changing it. I don't see any reason to. I'm seeing a purposeful orchestration of the Crown Vatican DC Corporation doing exactly what I was told they were going to do because I sound crazy. There's no fucking way anybody's going to listen to me. I've tried to talk to the FBI, the CIA. I've tried to talk to you. Even though I, I hit the day of lockdown on the day and two weeks later with the beef shortage, because that's why it had to happen when it happened. I knew something was coming and I started telling you and it's all over here on BitSheet because Susie won't allow it over here. So I won't be talking about what's over here, but you should get over here and look. Maybe that one would be a good one to look at. And if, as you're looking, look on this page, because you'll see where I posted these from my YouTube channel on here, but they're no longer there. But you might want to pay attention to the time, because this was well over six months before any of this began. And the accuracy. Well, it isn't prophecy. <laughs> it's the fact that I was told, I was told the day they offered me a bunker. I'm not guessing. I'm not sitting here telling you because I want to. I'm telling you we've got a couple of solutions here. One, we stop patriotizing murder for oil. Stop being so kind and, and praising our family for being the war machine and murdering for oil we don't need. We've got plenty here for 400 and some years. 500, 600 years in coal. And we don't need any of it. That, I've, I've shown over here several times. Free energy. Perpetual motion. I could have made a billion. But I gave it to you instead. What have you done with it? Besides sit here and tell me I'm wrong about what I'm saying. I've been right about everything I've said. The only thing I'm saying now is left that I know of coming is nuclear war, civil war here. They're going to disclose what they've done and they're working on it. I sat here and showed you a video right now that's been up for three weeks about this situation and what Fauci and them knew. They're rolling out with the truth, partial truth, and they're going to get people upset over what they've done. And you're going to burn the fucking neighborhoods down. Those immigrants moving into the cities aren't mothers and fathers. They're freaking troops. Y'all are easy to fool. I'm watching it. The end game roll out Russia went on high alert they activated their Satan 2 and the rest of their nukes they named all NATO fucking as target because we are doing what we're doing in Ukraine period that nobody's mad they want to keep you out of their bunkers. The only motivation there is. I'm not guessing. They know our planet's on its side. NASA just admitted it this year. Why don't you get out and look for yourself?